Welcome to the Regrid Mapping Platform. Today we'll be talking about the billing portion of a Regrid account, so canceling, changing your plan, that kind of thing. First thing to note here is that all that you'll see on the screen for this tutorial is uh, if you are accessing it via our web platform, so app.regrid.com, and signing in. If you have signed up via uh, our app, so what, Apple or Android, uh, the canceling process is different. Um, you'll want to find your subscriptions section in the phone, and then you'll be able to generally cancel the subscription from there if you so choose. So here on the platform, basically the first thing to do is go to the billing tab. Uh, and we have a couple options to make it easy to get there. You can click the handy go to billing button here um, on your projects tab. Alternately, you can always click your group dropdown wherever you are on the Regret platform and click plan and billing. Either way, that will take you to the billing tab where the rest of the billing information is stored and where these things uh, like changing plans can happen. So here on your billing tab, uh, a few main things to talk about here. So first of all, there's an account details section where you can see the relevant things that are happening with your plan, the amount, how often you pay, the number of users in your account, and the plan type. If you'd like to cancel your subscription, you can click the prompt, cancel your subscription here. Uh, give us any feedback that you would like to give us. And then finally click OK, really cancel this account down at the bottom, and that will stop the billing. You can always reopen an account at any time if you uh, so choose, um, but this will stop the payment until you uh, choose to come back later. There's a section on your card being used, uh, as well as an option to add a new card should you choose. And then down at the bottom, there is account history with the history of the payments that you've made and a download option if you would like to download an invoice for the specific payment. If you'd like to change your plan type, you'll want to click this change plan button. This will open up a menu where you can select from pro or team. Uh, the billing cycle, um, team is uh, generally a monthly only option. And then uh, use this slider to change the number of users if you're moving up to a team plan. Once you've got to where you'd like to go, you simply would click Confirm Change, and this will be reflected uh, after a short loading period. You'll probably see something different happen down at the account history, reflecting what you've just done, and the account details will update to what you've just made the change to.